Hey guys, Catrid Five Seal One here. I'm gonna be giving you a quick update on the new diorama I'm doing and an update on some other things. To start off, I'm gonna start off with the diorama. Um, I mentioned in one of my last videos that um, I tried doing a stop motion of moving into the yard for my company, but the table, the small one that I had that I planned to, was too small. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take those legs off and just take it down, and I'll show you what I'm gonna do, and I'm gonna store it away. And I ended up finding a bigger piece, and I'll show you that too. And right now, I'm kind of busy, just, um, I'm putting on the sides. I started putting on that side. It's going to look really nice. There's no legs, so I'm screwing them on the bottom. It's going to sit on those crates over there. Then I got my, um, power tool, power, um, I remember, I forgot the name, forgot the name of that. Sorry, I'm trying to think. Power tool, um, power drill, yeah. The drill bits, some screws, and then some more wood. The other piece, this is the last piece, this piece goes there. Then the other side, I had a piece just like this, but it was too small, so I cut a piece and then I'm gluing it with wood glue and nails, and that's going to go on this side. But the table's turning out really good, and all my models will fit on here, and it's, you know, it's going to look really nice. And then, the little table, like I said, I take off the legs, because I don't have any use for them, and I'll just use them for sides or something. I'm going to take this and I'll give it to my little brother or someone and I'll store it away someplace. But I'm going to be using the parking lot and then I'll use the road. Probably, I'm not sure. Then I'm going to find a building and I'm going to make it like that. Kind of make it look like this, a shop or something, paint it. I don't know, I have to get some dollar paint from that 99 cent store. What a bargain. Excuse me. But that's pretty much it for the diorama table. And I forgot to say, don't pardon the mess up here. It's kind of messy because all this stuff. Got my saw, the wood glue. The lights are up there in the back right now. And then I gotta fix my asphalt paper because someone broke the rail and the canopy. And then I lost one of the extensions last night, so I had to make that real quick out of cardstock. Exactly nice over there. Rotary tools because I was using it yesterday. Glasses right here. And I moved some models over here because I was cutting wood. And then I have dust mask and an MP3 listening to some music. And then general tools. Then for the couple other things, there's the light that I wanted to hang up. It looks really nice and it's positionable, so I can position it on that beam or that beam. Then here's another thing. I made a curtain so when I work at night, no one's looking at me. And it works like, um, well, let me see, it works like that, like a regular curtain on a curtain rod. I made it out of some cloth I found and some hooks and a curtain rod that I had. And it's really nice. I like it. It came out great. Took me about an hour and a half to do. But that's all of the updates and all the diorama table. And then I have one other thing. I'm going to be going to the store in a little bit. And I'm going to be buying a model. So I'll definitely do a model and bagging slash unboxing. But I'll tell you where you guys got it from. But that's in a whole different story. And desk is really dusty. But anyway, so that should be up along with this video in a little bit. So this yeah so that's pretty much it so let me double check and make sure it might be a quick pause hold on yep and that's pretty much it so thank you guys for watching and stay tuned